G'day and welcome to the weekly video blog. This is Adam McDougal. I'm Tomo. Uh, this week uh, we're talking about being healthy and, and it doesn't necessarily just come down to being fit and exercising and eating good food. Yeah, look, um, you know, that's a great start. Don't get me wrong, you know, it's fantastic if you're eating well and, and uh, you're exercising. But uh, there's three silent killers, I call them the three S's, which is basically sitting. Sitting now is becoming, you know, largely one of the biggest killers in our society. Yeah. If, you, if you sit for more than six hours a day, the actual chances of dying of a number of diseases just absolutely skyrocket. So, and, and why is that? Well, um, well, sitting firstly just brings your metabolism to a halt. Okay. So, and we weren't designed just to sit, you know. Sitting, uh, you know, does so many things. That it switches off, you know, your basic uh, your body's ability to utilise food, produce energy, um, your muscle mass uh, okay. is obviously affected and just your general health and well-being has some adverse effects. So my advice is every 20 minutes, make sure you get up and move. Mm -hmm. um, you know, for, And for example, when you do sit for a long period of time, all your muscles switch off, so your glutes in particular, your backside. So stand up and just move around. That'll get your metabolism firing again and also make you feel better as well. Um, stress is another huge one. Mm -hmm. um, it's a silent killer. Stress, it releases a hormone called cortisol um, and the higher levels of cortisol essentially leads to big uh, fat storage around the stomach. Um, we all know now that stomach fat is, is the biggest killer uh, for us. It strangles our organs, releases toxins which kill us. Um, so the big thing is is making sure we don't stress. So, so with that, is it is it a matter of doing, steering away from things which are stressful, which can be hard in a yeah. work environment, or is it about adding things in your life that can alleviate that, like, I don't know, meditation or something? Yeah, it's both. I think it's just finding, you know, even something that you enjoy doing will alleviate a lot of the stress. So, you know, having a few laughs with some of your mates, listening to some music that you enjoy, even sitting down for five minutes and shutting your eyes and just trying to relax and take a few deep breaths. Um, getting outside and getting some sunshine has been proven also really reduce your levels of stress. And, and I suppose trying to stay in the present is a big one. And that's mm. where exercise is great. When you're exercising or you're doing something you're you enjoy, moment. you're in yeah. the moment. And uh, you know, that's the thing about our minds. They're so busy and whatnot now. And that leads to, to the other uh, the type other of stress, which is sleep, uh, lack of sleep. Uh, which technology is having a huge part on that. A lot of guys uh, are on their devices before they go to bed and the blue light that's emitted from these technological devices, our phones, actually inhibit the release of uh, melatonin in our brains, uh, which actually reduces your ability to, uh, to sleep. sleep. Yeah, to yeah, sleep, right. so um, it wires you up, revs you up before you go to bed. So try to you know not watch you know TV, maybe uh, not be on the phone before you go to sleep. Make sure your room's nice and dark. And um, even have a hot shower as well, because then your body's trying to cool down after. Yeah, that I was going to say, is there, is there some things that you can increase the melatonin in your body? Yeah, yeah. Obviously, um, having a nice hot shower, trying to relax, reading a book okay. um, before you go to bed, and try not to eat too big a meal before you go to bed as well, because that'll sit on your guts as well, and blood flow will go into your stomach rather than helping you sleep and, and recover during night. So the free silent S's, which you might be thinking you're doing everything right, but as I touched upon, stress is a big one. Uh, sleeping and then sitting on your backside too much are free silent killers that will catch up with you. The three S's, guys, pretty simple to remember. Till next time, we'll see you then.